Hello everyone, today I would like to show you Grinder from Parkside. It's Grinder PFBS 160B2. I bought it for home projects, especially for grinding and cutting. In box you can find Grinder. Three meters cable, adjustable LED light, access accessories, telescopic stand. which can be mounted on the table. So it's quite handy and useful. Also you have flexible shaft. which is mounted to the grinder here so length of this tool is roughly 22 centimeters Diameter is fifty six millimeters. Sorry, fifty three millimeters. Weight of this grinder is roughly five hundred grams which is quite a lot in the box you also find adjustable tool for uh, setting of high um, I'm not used it up to now but for some people could be useful After a few months of usage, I have seen few pros and cons. We can start with pros. This grinder uh, has power 160 watts, what is more than enough for most uh, jobs. What can you do with this type of grinder? So, from my point of view, it's more than enough regarding to the power. Second advantage is price. Price in Europe is roughly 25 euro, which is very interesting price. I also bought it because of good price. On the other side, I saw also some disadvantages. So we can start with first one. Flexible shaft, which is in the box, produce quite strong vibration and heats up really quickly. So I don't recommend it for fine works. I also uh, use, because of this problem, I just use main um, grinder without shaft because I think this shaft is not usable for most of the jobs. Second disadvantage is noise. 
Now you will hear uh, noise during a different speed from 10,000 RPM to 40,000 RPM. You can start with 10,000. <coughs> also, 40,000. Please write it as a max. This grinder is not new, maybe therefore you can use some strange noise, but also thanks to this usage of this grinder I can uh, say to you some pros and cons, because I am using it for many months. In the end it's not bad grinder. For occasional work it's quite good for this money, but if you need something for precise work or fine work, you should go to other uh, label or other grinder, for example Proxon has quite good grinders. I have some experience uh, with Micromod 230E it is uh, roughly three times more expensive but there is huge difference between noise and vibration I think if you go to this grinder it will be good choice for this money in general now we can try cutting a screw which is not a problem for this grinder. So, we start with the screw. We set 20,000 RPM. We can continue with wood. You can also see different with light. and plastic. Quite fast. If you like this video and enjoy it, please give me a like or subscribe my channel. It helps me to improve my content, which will be in the end better for you. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.